Uh, dear students, so today we will learn that how we can download uh, uh, a new tool that is called a Tableau tool for visualization. So uh, for this one, you can easily write on the on the Google that download Tableau desktop. So you will have this thing. So after this one, you will see there will be a link appearing to you. And then after that one, you can start downloading the free trial of it, right? So um, it has a uh, different uh, uh, versions, which is related to uh, desktop version, online version, and uh, live version, public version. So it has a different version. So we will try the uh, the desktop version and see that how it downloads and how it works. So since I have already downloaded, as you can see in my download list, so uh, so it is downloaded again. And after it has been downloaded, so it is just a matter of clicks, and you can easily uh, download it. Right. So once you have downloaded all this one, so what will happen? Um, an icon like this one will appear on your desktop. So this is a trial version and it will work uh, for I think 14 days and this 14 days you can use it and you can uh, enjoy the uh, the functionality of, of the Tableau uh, for visualization. So we learned about Excel, we learned about Power BI and now we are learning about the Tableau and we will explore the different features and the limitations. So we will continue for the trial version. If we click on the trial version, so we will have this kind of... Uh, uh, screen and here you can see you can like you know play with the Microsoft Excel file you can import that one you can connect with the Tableau server you can import the text file you can import the JSON file JSON a special file semi structured data file even you can uh, play with the Microsoft access data file you can import the PDF file you can import the spatial file statistical file so file wise you have like you know a lot of options available here right? so this is that and how it looks so let's try with the uh, with some sample workbooks okay so i will check with the with this the first data and we can see that how we can calibrate and how can we uh, play with the different kinds of data and what are the features facility it has so this is uh, one of the the data which is related to the uh, customer data so you can see over here so first i will click on the data source so in the data source i can see that how the data is like you know connected what are the different categories in the data so you can see over here category we have order date we have a segment we have a sales target so this is like you know the explanation of the data and how it is connect how they're connected to each other now we will click on the overview so this is the overview of the uh, all the data you can see like about the pro if you if you, there are different sheets over here if you click on the on the performance you can click on the forecast okay, if you want if you see all the what if analysis right uh, if you want to see the total sales you can see here if you click on the sales map okay if you click on the sales by the segment and sales by the product okay so now the second one is tab is more about like you know about the product drill down so drill down means like if you want to uh, just like you know if you want all the data so then you can click over here if you want to like you know only the eastern data so it is kind of like you know looks like a dashboard and if you want like you know south data so it will give you the south data only if you want the west data it will give you the western data now about the customer like you know data if you see over here so here also you can have some uh, specific selections over here and then based on that one you can uh, you can have your data right so you can see you can like you know increase your data so this software is very user friendly but it has a certain limitations as well so we will discuss it later on okay so uh, the these are like you know some further more data performance data about the customer customer model that how it looks okay um, order details data okay these two are more important forecast so for example if you want to know about the future forecast for example till uh, september i think this is november and then we have yeah till november 2023 the the sales was forty nine thousand seven hundred ninety dollars right but now we don't know about the december okay so december is like in january you can see january sales is expected to be lower and then it is arising in the february and it is like you know on uh, 
in September it will be more higher again right and, and then in October it will go down and similarly uh, for like you know corporate you can also see the the prediction to 2024 so this is called forecasting right so the good thing in in uh, in this software is that it gives you forecast called forecasting as well second most important thing is that what if analysis like you know what if forecasting so what if forecasting is also uh, available over here so you can see what if forecast based on the sales 60 percent growth and 6.5 on the churn so these are like you know overall facilities in this one let's see some other facilities over here we have like you know you can import your need data source um, uh, from the different whether it's like i told you you have the different options here like uh, text file microsoft excel access even database pdf so these are like you know uh, different options you have it and then worksheets you can have you can uh, import the worksheets directly uh, uh, dashboards you can create your own new dashboard let's see let's try some of the dashboards we have it so if you want to for example if you this is the m2 one and if you want to have a uh, like you know uh, put some data just cl the click on it so there will be a green click tick on that one so the dashboard data will be here if you want to include the forecast data it will also be included and automatically adjust just like power bi and if you want the, for, um, the what if analysis so what if forecast analysis will also be included in it right so this is like you know a sample like you know a dashboard we can make it quickly uh, as we learned in data visualization that uh, we need to make a story from uh, from our um, from our data and visualization so you can make your own story you can make for example they say the uh, story of uh, let's suppose uh, um, customers uh, loyalty building for example this is like one of the story right and then if you want to add something like you know uh, you can look at like you know drag and drop here you can drag and drop this one right okay so you can make a story and then you know this is number one story and number two story and you can like you know save your story as well so depending on that one so you can make a you can give a name to a story and that the story will be built for you so and then you have some analysis if you want to some more analysis you can do some along with the different settings so you can do the setting and then and then analysis can be performed so based on these settings your analysis will be performed okay formatting you can also do it sometime you need formatting so this tab is only for formatting and animation this is for connecting with the servers if you want to connect with the servers uh, and as i told you that it has different versions so tableau public this is free but here your privacy of the data will not be there so uh, in in case if your data is not sensitive you can use it and it's open access so you can use even if your license expired you can use this one okay and these, these these are like you know different uh this there is optimizer as well for your data and uh, these are usually the windows and help so so this is like you know the full elaboration of this software and then uh you can try with the different data and uh, make yourself familiar with this uh, new software uh, this is very handy and it is used by the various companies in internationally uh, and especially in gulf stc uh, is using this one um, and uh, it has a good remarkable results so thank you very much see you in the next video